measure the float switch cable length 0.6 meters. From the suction point of the pump, measure 0.6 meters and on the power cable, slit the outer core. Cut the neutral cable into two. This is where you will fit the float switch. Slit the float switch cable about 5 cm, then remove the outer core. Chop the blue cable out of the float switch for high level sensoring. Fit the red cable onto the blue cable of the pump. and use the PVC tape to seal it tightly after twisting it using the pliers. Fit the black cable onto the other end of the blue cable of the pump and twist together then seal with tape. Position the float switch cable joint on top of the pump cable and fit it with PVC tape. Chop both ends of the mold with a knife. Fit the mold onto the joint area and position it properly. And seal both ends using the PVC tape to prevent joint resin from coming out. Position it properly on a flat surface. Take the splicing kit and remove the resin inside. Remove the flap separating the resin and mix thoroughly for about four minutes. Pour the joint resin into the mold and wait for it to dry. It takes about 8 hours for it to dry properly. 